whatever the animation is, you know, if the character is screaming, I gotta make them scream. If they're crying, I gotta make them cry. With uh, Devil May Cry 4, it was a script, and so I just, you know, I basically got to do whatever I wanted to do and made my own choices. Um, plus, I got to go to Japan, which made it even cooler than just a regular, and uh, did the motion capture stuff, so. Wow, that, that is... Wow, uh, that, that's, that's tough. Um, I love doing Perceptor, you know, because it's different from my voice. Um, Campbell, uh, Metal Gear, he's pretty cool, because he's a real big, tough guy. Uh, and, which is really who I am inside. Uh, one of my favorite roles, one, seriously, one of my favorite characters is, is something that nobody knows because it was only on for a short time, and I don't know if it was ever came out over here, called the, the Toxic Crusaders. Oh, really? Well, I was Nozone. Nozone was a hideously deformed creature of superhuman size and strength. And he had flown through a hole in the ozone. He was a test pilot. And he f crashed into a vat of radioactive pepper. It can happen. So he fused with, his, with the airplane. He had one leg that was a, uh, the, uh, the wheel of an airplane. And he had a huge nose. And his power was sneezing. And he could mow down forests with a sneeze. And he would talk like this. And he would, he would, <laughs> and he would, he would sneeze. And they, they literally had to bring in towels because it, it would get awfully messy. That was one of my favorite roles. Um, gosh, it's been a, been a lot of fun stuff. Anything that runs for a while, Grandpa Max, you know, that's the, that's the, 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 the dad and the grandfather I want to be. So I love doing Grandpa Max. Yeah, it's nice when, it, when you get to get into a role for a while. It's not just a one-off. You can do it for a few years. Uh, so Leonardo was, was a big one for me. Um, doing it for seven years in a room with my brothers was really, really fun. I don't actually have any brothers, so it was fun to have make-believe mutated ninja turtle brothers. Uh, you take what you can get when you're an only child. But um, the, uh, that was huge. Also, just getting into the... This is going to sound a bit corny, but getting into the spirit of being Leonardo, he's so noble and righteous and, and disciplined and things that I strive to be. So it was nice to have to get into his head every week over and over again. And actually, when I got the job, I thought I was going to be replaced. Uh, oh, good. Uh, but do you guys know Sean Schemmel? He's a uh, Goku? Yeah. He was like, oh, it's perfect that you're him. Whoa, when I got cast as Goku, I, I was born year of the monkey, and he's a monkey king, and, and you're Leo, and you're playing Leo, because you're born August 13th. You're Leo, you're perfect. I was like, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, and then the way, and he, anyway, he made all these parallels between my character and Leonardo, and it made me feel more confident, so thanks, Sean. What, no, it's not like he's dead. I don't know why I'm pointing up to the sky. <laughs> we love you, Sean <laughs> It didn't have to happen so soon. Um, but uh, also, there were two others. There was, um, the Venture Brothers is huge and hilarious, and I don't, maybe three of you have seen it, but it's a lot of fun, and the way it's written is ridiculous, and the voice is high and wee and nerdy, and I'm also a big nerd, so that's nice. Um, and, uh, oh, there's a show that you will never see, probably, called Robotomy. No one's heard of it, have you? If, raise a hand awesome. if you've even, you've heard of it? <laughs> and you think it's awesome? Yes, it's actually awesome, but, but it, it was sort of squashed by the network. They said, we can't sell it internationally because it's too violent. It's basically a home world of the Decepticons, and they all maim each other for no good reason but to be funny, uh, because destruction is awesome and flowers are lame. But um, it, it's, it's like that. Uh, so anyway, the, um, uh, that was fun. I was hired to direct it, and then the show creators were doing a table read, just seeing how the script sounded before we bring in the cast. And they were like, oh, you're good at that. You should play these parts. And they gave me like four parts. One of them was named Weenus. Um, <laughs> so that was fun. And, um, and it was the weirdest voice I've ever done. And that was like, lobotomy, if you can find it any way you can, just try to look at it. Because they just squashed it and it doesn't exist anymore. It's, we had Pat Oswalt. He's Ratatouille in it. And um, all these comedians. Uh, Gilbert Gottfried and Louis Black, Lisa Lampanelli. Little John, the rapper. Do you know who he is? He's famous for saying, what? And yeah! Anyway, he was in it. His catchphrase. What and yeah? That's not a phrase, it's a word. Anyway, sorry, that's it. This young lady here. <laughs>